started off together so many years ago danced in the sunshine and made angels in the snow our lives were filled with innocence this world it turned so slow now my most beloved friend together we grow old back to a time that I, when I was in Vietnam and I walked, a, walked away from a little an incident that had happened. And I was in military intelligence. I was in MACD headquarters. I was in the top echelon of military command in Saigon. And, and I asked my first critical question of my life, because I grew up in a Republican family, you know. But I walked away from that and I said, what's going on here? What's really going on here? And that was the first time that I really asked a critical question. I mean, where I was, General Abrams, the commanding general, was ten doors down from me. I mean, that's 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 where I was, and um, and I struggled with what I did um, after that. And then, um, when I came back, it was a whole group of us, and we were educating each other. And I became, I started to become active at that at that point. I was still in the army and became a member of Vietnam Vets Against the War, and, and then went from there. I can't see, I can't see. <laughs> so, um, when the Iraq War started, I, uh, I wrote a song, I've got a feeling I've been here before. Mm -hmm. And then seven years into the war, I changed the chorus. Uh, now's the time to end this stinking war. These songs don't, can't work without voices, so you all have to join in. Right? So, but the, uh, the original chorus went, I got feeling I've been here before, in a desert, in a dirty little war. Young men can die so fast, but God does not be fast. I got feeling I've been here before. And when it changed, now this is your part, Now's the time to end this thing and walk. Why I'm singing these songs tonight is that we're back in it. Mm -hmm. Right. You know, it, we're back in it. I, I, and where I thought we were pulling out, you know, now it looks like we're going back. And I, I do a lot of work with Iraqi refugees, and I was, I was at one of the houses. Anyway, and his, his family is from Mosul. The family took off, and they're now up with the Kurds. And uh, you know, we we heard that there was 1,500, right? He said, no, it's over 10,000. I said, what are you talking about? You know? And he said that it's uh, mercenaries and and uh, 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 paid uh, henchmen. You know, that are he said they're they're in combat. And uh, and he said the Americans. I said, well, it was only 1,500 American troops that are advisors. He said, no, they're no, it's different than that, you know, so, but the things that we don't know, so we go, now's the time in this thinking war, bring them home, don't send any more, many young have died from oil and a bunch of lies, now's the time to end this thinking war, now's the time to end this thinking war, bring them home, don't send any more. Many young have died for oil and a bunch of flies. Now's the time to end the singing war. Wow, that's pretty good. Now's the time to end the singing war. Bring them home, don't send any more. Many young have died for oil and a bunch of flies. Now's the time to end the singing war. Saigon, Palooza, Fanta, Camera, Ready. Ready to go. 
come ashore. Students yelling, stop the war. Clergy preaches wars of sin. Generals say this time will win. I've got a feeling I've been here before. Choppers hover over distant sky. Mothers again are asking why. Why is my son of just 19 killing with an M16? I got a feeling I've been here before. Sing with me. Now's the time to end this thing at war. Bring them home, don't send them anymore. Too many young have died with oil and a bunch of lies. Now's the time to end this thing at war. Quack, quack, I heard a soldier shout. Easy in, not so easy out. Just by the goddamn luck, over here a sitting duck. I got a feeling. I've been here before. A monument built for the Viet Vets. For a war we'd like to all forget. There's plenty of room left on the mall. Why, we can build another wall. Now's the time to end this thing at war. Well, now's the time to end this thing at war. Bring them home, don't send any more. started two wars, and, but especially the Iraq War, that um, uh, it's, in my mind is totally illegal, and they knew it. And uh, so I have a little song. Another single one. <laughs> surprise, surprise. <laughs> <laughs> I say lock them up, lock them up. You say lock them up. Lock them up, lock them up, lock them up. Lock them up. Lock the bastards up and throw the key away. You say, far away. Far, far away. A few years down in Gitmo, then life in Abu Ghraib. Make sure their sorry asses never see the light of day. <laughs> Boy, that would be a happy day for me. Anyway. So, lock them up. Lock them up. Lock them up. Lock them up. Lock the bastards up and throw the key away. Far away. Few years down to get my old and life and all the grave. Make sure their sorry asses never see the light of day. And GW had us all believe that WMD were there. He looked all over Baghdad, he looked under his chair. He knew that if the truth were known, we'd never go to war. So he stuck right to his story, then he lied to us some more. Lock him up, lock him up, lock him up, lock him up. Lock the bastard up and throw the key away, far away. A few years down, get mold and life and all the grave. Make sure their sorry asses never see the light of day. Well, Cheney, the puppeteer, had Georgie on the string. He knew once in the White House he could do most anything. He was the man who had the plan. This was just a tool. He knew it would be easy cause the puppet was a fool. Lock him up, lock him up, lock him up, lock him up, lock the bastard up and throw the key away, far away. A few years down, get more than life in Abu Ghraib. Make sure your sorry asses never see the light of day. Well, Rummy was no dummy. He could make them squeal. Electrodes and the gonads will tie him to the wheel. Dunk them in some water, it's not torture, we not know. Just friendly persuasion, that's the truth, I swear to God. Lock him up, 
Lock him up, lock him up, lock him up, lock the bastard up and throw the key away, far away. A few years down to get mold and wiping off a grave, make sure their sorry asses never see the light of day. Well, Condi was so adamant on the evening news, Saddam Hussein was going to nukes, that's why he had the tubes. It didn't matter that she knew that none of that was true. She only wanted to scare the crap out of me and you. Lock her up, lock her up, lock her up, lock her up. Lock the liar up and throw the key away, far away. A few years down, get mold and wipe and all the break. Make sure their sorry asses never see the light of day. Well, Colin Powell was chosen at the president's request to make the case at the UN. He chose to be the best. Those mobile labs would put his But he was lying through his teeth, just like all the rest. Lock him up, lock him up, lock him up, lock him up. Lock the bastard up and throw the key away, far away. A few years down, get mold and wipe up a grave. Make sure their sorry asses never see the light of day. Lock them up, lock them up, lock them up, lock them up. Lock the bastards up and throw the key away, far away. A few years down, get mold and wipe up. Words not the answer. And thank you for making the sound that it's lines promoting my song. Thank you. <laughs> um, uh, in, um, I was sitting on the couch and, and they announced uh, that John Lennon had just died. And, oh, no, they, I'm sorry, it was the 30th anniversary of John Lennon's death. He did just die. The 30th anniversary. And I thought to myself, what would John be singing today about? What, what, where would he be? You know, in his evolution, and it's a common phrase: "War is not the answer." And I, and I said, you know, "War is not the answer." And I, then I got up, and I was walking in the kitchen, and I just said to myself, you know, "Never was and never will." And I went, huh? And I sat down, and I think John was giving me some inspiration, and so, the, and and then there's a there's a verse in here that we had gone down to the uh, White House, Veterans for Peace, and we had a bunch of supporters with us. And, um, and this was like a month later, and um, uh, 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 over 100 vets, was over, I think it was like 120 people got arrested that day, but 100 vets, we were at the gates of the White House, and we got arrested. And Daniel Ellsberg was with us, and you know, Chris Hedges, and, and others, and, um, and on my way home from that, flying back to Boston, I said, what this song needs is, a, is another verse about peace standing at the gate. You know, you just have to reach over, it's there, you know. The opportunity is there, so we can, you know. And so I wrote, wrote that verse. Um, we also, thanks to Chapter 45 and other veterans for peace and, and other groups, we made a music video. So we can go home, go to YouTube and look up War Is Not The Answer. And we, uh, you know. And so, <clears throat> so the, the, the chorus goes, War is not the answer, never was, never was. We will never live in peace unless and until we learn to love each other, that bomb, maim, and kill. All those war is not the answer, never was, and never will. Easy enough, right? War is not the answer, never was, never will. We will never live in peace unless and until we learn to love each other, not bomb, maim, and kill. Because war is not the answer. Never was, never will. Let's try it out one time. War is not the answer. Never was, never will. We will never live in peace unless and until we learn to love each other, not bomb, name, and kill. Call the war is not the answer. Never was, and never will. War is not the answer. Never was, never will. We will never live in peace unless and until. We learn to love each other, not bomb, name, and kill. All those wars got the answer, never will, and never will. Think of all the weapons we make around the world. Investing brains and money 
the end the best way is to have kill. If we could use that money for the betterment of man and care about each other, there'd be peace throughout the land. War is not the answer, never was, never will. We will never live in peace unless and until we learn to love each other, not bound, name it. So by the time I got out, I totally missed that song. And that was, and I listened to it and I went, wow, this is really a great song from Bobby Darren. Now it had some antiquated verses in it. It had some little borderline races. So I changed some, I changed some, uh, some verses and, uh, and I added a couple verses. This is the, the Bobby Darren song. I guess I can say Bobby Darren and Pat Scanlon song. It's, uh, Pretty obvious in the verses that I wrote, but um, this is, it's, it's got a great little tune to it. But come and sing a simple song of freedom. Anybody know this? I think so. Oh, you do. Okay. How <laughs> it, 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 uh, it goes Come and sing a simple song of freedom. Sing it like you've never sung before. Let it fill the air, tell the people everywhere. We the people here don't want a war. Isn't that a nice, isn't that great? Mm -hmm. It's just, come and sing a simple song of freedom. Sing it like you've never sung before. Let it fill the air, tell the people that we're there. We the people here don't want a war. Come and sing a simple song of freedom. Yeah. 
like you've never heard a song before. Let it fill the air, tell the people everywhere. Be the people here no more. Seven hundred million are you listening? Most of what you read is paid of light. Speaking one to one, ain't it everybody's son? I just want to be someone known to you as me. And I would bet my life you want the same. I didn't sing a simple song of freedom. Singing like you've never heard a song before. But let it fill the air, tell the people everywhere. Be the people here no more. Some folks enjoy doing battle. Presidents, prime ministers, and kings. Well, let us build them shelves so they can fight amongst themselves. Be the people, be who want to sing. Come and sing a simple song of freedom. Sing it like you've never heard a song before. Well, let it fill the air, tell the people everywhere. Be the people here. you 